Yo, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're doing gameplay with the brand new Amethyst Devon Booker, the reward or the second reward for this legendary path collection that locks in for Diamond Shack. Didn't really want to do it, but I felt like I got to get y'all gameplay, man. So we're going to lock him in. The whole set cost 100,000 VC, 101,000 VC. So it is going to be like 25 bucks basically is the equivalent. So it's kind of expensive, which I am not thrilled about. And I don't want to keep locking all these in. I'll probably try to get gameplays on other people's accounts for a lot of this stuff, but I decided to do it myself because D-Book does look really fun and really, really good. So we're going to try him out for y'all today. Also get you also Amari, Steven Jackson gameplays later on today as well. Before we hop into the video, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Help me push towards the 13,000 subscriber mark on the channel. I upload every Every single day i would really appreciate it if y'all do subscribe but without further ado let's hop right into it so we got d book 65 93 offense 77 defense with an 88 driving late 88 draw foul close shot 91 midi 87 three ball 75 driving dunk is solid 88 ball handle is great he's an elite offensive car defensively not great at all 74 perimeter the rest of the defensive stats are really poor 79 speed and excel 74 lateral quickness so not gonna do a lot on the defensive end of the court but he does have two hall of fame badges blinders and menu edition as well as gold pro touch agent three dead eye green machine guard up slippery off ball bailout handles for days free points open looks silver badges like catch and shoot corner specialist limitless range break starter unpluckable bunny uh float game whistle physical handle speed boost is a big one triple strike bronze fast twitch claymore dimer chase down artist spin cycle blow by a lot of good badges on this devin booker card and he looks like a really really good offensive card with a lot of versatility on that end of the court so we're going to try this d book card out on our account and we're going to see how good he really is at the shooting guard position because he might be my new best my new starting shooting guard and maybe my new favorite shooting guard in the game until we get brandon roy so maybe you shouldn't have paid for this card but i'm excited to try him out for sure so d books burst is uh his his actual like side his actual burst is not that great but if you know how to do the timing burst to get a good burst his uh, good burst is i mean his size up isn't great and it's kind of hard to trigger but it's not bad like he will get some good movement animations right there as y'all see and his release is absolutely cash money of course we know book always has one of the best early game releases and uh, as y'all can see man you get this timing burst down i might have to make a video on how to do that timing burst but if you get that down it's going to make it a lot easier to dribble with cards like dbook that may not have the best dribble styles because his dribble style right now is not that great the timing burst is going to be a lot less important later in the year when everybody has an elite dribble style but right now they don't so learning that animation might be very very useful and uh yeah overall book i mean the release is elite the slashing should be very solid as well the defense will not be great but it will be okay on the perimeter he's got decent enough size i think booker is going to be the second best shooting guard in the game after um Brandon Roy, who only like one or two people have right now, but uh, B B Book should still be certainly elite, and I'm super excited to try the card out. So let's hop into a game. Let's see what Devin Booker can do. All right, our opponent is uh, OG Sizzle. He's got Dame, Mike Miller, Iggy, Aaron Gordon, DeAndre Ayton. Very solid squad for sure. We have pretty equal squads for the most part. My team's a little better. I got Kyrie and Booker, so my backcourt is definitely better. But our front courts are pretty similar, and this should be a pretty solid test right now. I mean, not the best team in the world, but I have played this dude before on Unlimited. If I remember correctly, he was pretty good. I think I even used his account for a gameplay or something last year as well. If I remember correctly, I used OG Sizzle's account for gameplays a couple times. So huge shout out to him for that, for letting me use his account for those. W mans. But uh, I had kind of forgotten about that until just now. But here we go. Attacking downhill with Kyrie, kicking it to a catch and shoot Booker from the midi. And that's an easy bucket. Starting us off with an easy knockdown jumper from D Book. And we're going to get right into the defensive end of the court. Hopefully get ourselves some stops. Uh, my, my controller is feeling a little sticky today. I'm struggling a little bit, I feel like. But D book with good contests there prevents Mike Miller from getting off a shot. Doesn't really have to do a ton in the matchup against a guy like Mike Miller. Uh, just don't let him shoot the ball, basically, because Mike is a little bit slow. Not going to be much of a shot creator or anything. But there's push cross here. Bro Booker with his normal burst. Nice move by Devin Booker. Oh, my. Not really nice. Push cross into the size up. Got the burst back to the right side. Stops and pops from the four point line. And D book with quick four points right there. That is what you love to see right there on the offensive end of the court. Really good offense. Did not mean to jump there again. Like, I don't. What did I hit the trigger to jump there? I don't think I hit the Y button. I'm not sure what's going on here, but regardless, let's see if we can get a self a stop and uh, really start to stack this lead, push it out a little bit. Good defense here. Color contest Lillard. Good. That was actually a really nice size up there. He got the burst, but does dr draw an illegal screen. That's a little bit unlucky for him. But I am not going to complain as it gives us another chance to get Devin Booker to continue to be involved on the offensive end of the court. So let's go size up in and out move here. Uh, size up beautiful Devin Booker with the burst attacking downhill hitting our pop. The playmaking is immaculate Devin Booker off the burst hits the pop easy three ball great assist and this offense is looking really nice right now. Six points and one assist for Booker. He is just getting to his spots and pretty much getting whatever he wants both as a playmaker and as 
a scorer right now. Good hop step, good layup. Dame does get back on the board, and he is only down by five, so it's only a two possession game. Game ain't over yet or anything, but or it's looking pretty good so far. Hit our pop to Weber. He's jumping all over the place, but unfortunately, the one person he does not help off of is Devin Booker. But good move by Book. Fade, Book, fade me, Book. Oh my goodness, he hit the white. Let's go. I don't generally expect to hit a white there, but Booker hits it, knocks that one down. Great shot again from Devin Booker, and he's got himself nine points. And oh, by the way, he has takeover that can be activated when we get back on the offensive end of the court. So, oh, and there it is right there. Takeover activates for Devin Booker. He's running transition. Did not mean to shoot a pull up. I'm lucky to hit that. I didn't green it. I'll take the bucket because he had takeover, but was definitely going coast to coast for the jam there. And unfortunately pulls up the mid range earlier than I intended to. Good burst there again. He's doing a nice job of like dribbling a little bit, but not doing a ton in terms of actually getting a lot of open shots right now. And we're looking really nice by right now. Behind the back, Devin Booker attack the rim. Spin for me. D book. Yes, sir. Pump, pump, pack it out. Come on, books. Come set me a screen now. Let's go. We're, we're switching it up a little bit. Ball handler is the center. D book is the screener. Drag back. D book. Pull up. D book. Oh my goodness, you're cooking. Hit another white. I haven't hit this many whites, period yet, bro. I'm not greening right now, which is bad because D book has a super butter release. But damn, I'm hitting whites like crazy. This card might be the man as a shooter. Great defense by Weber as well. Getting a little bit of a fake contest. Swing it over to book again. Book catch shoot green. Bam. Devin Booker, absolute sniper, 17 points and one assist right now. Got to say, I like this card better than Clay right now as a pure offensive card. Now, Clay gives you a lot more on the defensive end of the court, but I cannot argue with 17 points right now. And Devin Booker just getting buckets on and off the ball at a very consistent level. Look at that burst to the Ram. Booker lays it up and then nice little floater, float layup right there. And we get it to go for our 19th points of the game. I mean... Yeah, I love what I'm seeing. The only thing I'm struggling with right now is my icons are being weird on defense. It's not triggering when I'm inputting icons and stuff, but everything else seems to be working just fine. Book stops, pops again. I feel confident shooting that. I missed it, but I honestly don't think that was that bad of a shot. I know it was a late. I just mistimed it. I think that's a makeable shot with Devin Booker with sharp shooting takeover. That is a shot that I'm going to shoot with confidence and we missed it, but that is a okay. I mean, can't argue with 19 points, right? So book again, um, come set me a nice little screen policy. If we can get ourselves a little bit of clearance, pushing up the court. He's trying to bait me. He's not there. Front face. Devin Booker 4-3 I thought I drilled that that's a shot I feel like I can definitely hit as well I'm not shooting very well right now in terms of actually greening shots Booker's just hitting a lot of shots because they're getting we're doing a great job of creating space he's moving really nicely but got to do a little bit better job in terms of greening my shots I think size up here again Booker stop hit it down again I mean what are you supposed to do, man? This Devin Booker card is hard to stop because you have to pay so much attention to him as a, as a scorer and as a shooter that he can be a really nice playmaker as well. In terms of a secondary ball handler, you have him next to a guy like Kyrie Irving, Damian Lillard. I mean, you're not going to get a better secondary offensive shooting guard right now. Not a ton of defense, but as long as you have a lock at the three and maybe if, especially if you have a guy like Kyrie at PG who's a pretty good defender, a Joe Dumars, somebody along those lines who can defend a little bit, I feel like it's not that big of a deal right now that Booker's not a good defender because we're so early in the year that you don't need elite defense defensive players at every position and Booker's offense can be really, really useful. So uh, that's about all I got to say on that, though. He's going to get himself a wide open four pointer. Good shot right there. 30 seconds left. Let's just close out this game and let's hop back into the main menu to review this Devin Booker card because 19 points, two assists. He cooked in this game, bro. I mean, in conclusion, Devin Booker finishes with, what, 22 points and three assists in that game. He was eight of 10 from the field and five of seven from three. That is efficiency, consistency, just an absolutely elite performance by Devin Booker, a card that I'm actually very, very high on. He's very, very good right now in my team. And I definitely think if you are in need of a shooting guard, Devin Booker is going to be absolutely elite as that man. So very impressed by this card, all things considered. And uh, offensively, he's elite. Defensively, maybe not so much. I would recommend not probably paying to lock in cards like this this early in the year. I'm really only doing it for the videos, and maybe I shouldn't even be doing that. But... I don't know. I probably wouldn't recommend it myself, but D book is a great card and I definitely recommend it if you're looking for somebody to fill a spot on your squad. So that is good for this video. Hope y'all did enjoy. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment and subscribe. I'll be back with more 2K content very, very soon. I appreciate y'all. Peace.